Preface of Mari, Our Little Norwegian Cousin This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Mari, Our Little Norwegian Cousin by Mary Hazelton Blanchard Wade Preface Long before Columbus discovered America, there were brave men in the north of Europe who dared to sail farther out upon the unknown waters of the Atlantic than any other people in the world. These daring seamen were called Vikings. Their home was the peninsula of Scandinavia, now ruled over by one king, although divided into two distinct countries, Norway and Sweden. It was along the shores of Norway, with rugged mountains fringing its deep bays, that the Vikings learned command of their curious, high-proud ships, and overcame all fear of wind and storm. Their strong nature shows itself today in the people of Norway, who patiently endure many hardships while trying to get a living on the rough mountain sides or along the rocky coasts. Many of our Norwegian cousins have come to America to make a new home for themselves where the sun shines more warmly and the winds blow less keenly. Their fair-haired children are growing up amongst us, showing us the qualities their parents most admire. Be brave, be honest, be kind to all creatures, be faithful to every little duty. These are the lessons they have been taught from babyhood, as well as the brothers and sisters who have not as yet ventured far from the land they love so well, the land of rapid-flowing rivers, deep, dark bays, and narrow valleys. Come with me today to the home of one of these blue-eyed cousins and join her for a while in her work and play.